So we know a lot of Afghan refugees are coming here. How many exactly? Where are they going? How are they being processed when they get here? We have answers to some of those questions tonight. Here's what we've learned from government sources. Dulles Airport in right outside Washington is a main welcoming site for flights landing at all hours of the day filled with Afghan refugees. As of this morning, just under 3,700 men from Afghanistan have been processed at Dulles. One recent flight landed there with nearly 200 evacuees. Homeland Security officials are currently discussing opening similar sites at other airports around the country. DHS has also been, also been soliciting volunteers to staff its processing centers overseas. There are currently three of those that are vetting refugees in Bahrain, Qatar, and Germany. The administration is planning to open four other overseas processing sites. DHS's goal, it says, is to process 10,000 refugees every day at many of these overseas locations. So we reached out to DHS for comment on Friday. A spokesman there said that they are, quote, working around the clock to ensure individuals are screened against U.S. government databases prior to arriving in the U.S. and upon arrival. These are the people who had no idea the Taliban were going to take Kabul in a weekend. What will happen? Well, their attitudes, a lot of good people, but are very different from those of most Americans. A new poll by Pew found that 99 percent of Afghan Muslims support, for example, enacting Sharia law. So many Republicans in Congress have no problem with this at all. In fact, some of those want us to evacuate Afghans from Kabul before we get all Americans citizens out of the country. One of those Republicans, not surprisingly, is Ben Sass of Nebraska, the single guiltiest white man in America. Sass said over the weekend that we need to take in as many refugees as possible because America has given its word. He didn't say to whom. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.